Hi, I'm Sam from Walks Derwent and Dales in Derbyshire. Today I'm going to take you on a circular walk from a small village called Hogneston, which is a few miles out of Ashbourne in northeasterly direction. This village is very typical of a Derbyshire village. Lots of stone houses, some brick houses, but you can see lovely cottages behind me. I've got Phil joining me on a walk today. Do you want to say hello, Phil? Hi. <laughs> So come with me, enjoy the walk. We've had a little climb to get to the top here. The views that we've got, you can probably just see them in the background. It's a Carsington water, uh, a, a lovely reservoir, which we can walk all the way around, but we tend to uh, walk so we can get the views of it. So the views, it's a bit dark and gray today. The rain is a potential. In fact, I thought we were going to get more rain now, but it's okay. And Jill has just said something to me and about how she feels about being out on a day like today. Do you want to repeat that to everyone, Jill? It's absolutely fantastic. It's a day to feel alive being out here. Brilliant. And it really is. So it doesn't matter what the weather is. We do come out in almost all weathers as long as it's safe to do so. at our trig point of Madge Hill. Madge Hill is one of the highest points in the area at 299 metres. And just to the left you can see Carsington Water through the hedge line and we're going to scan across down to the hills of Leicestershire. You see we're just going to zoom in to a power station in the far distance which is Ratcliffe on Saw. And dropping down in front of the valley in front of us will be the village of Atlo. Look at those views. So it's great because since we've been walking, the clouds have really lifted, so it enables us to have this fine view across the hills here. Cunning right from the Weaver Hills, we've got the high ground stretching north of the hills of Dovedale. As you can see as we zoom in, the top of Thought Cloud, the classic flat top. So we couldn't see this when we walked up here about 10 minutes ago. It was covered in cloud. But as we walk back, it's all cleared so we can see it now and share the views with you, which is great. On a clear day, you can see the Shropshire Hills and you can spot the Requin. So we're going to walk back down this track just for a short distance and there's a stile through the hedge we're going to cut through into the fields now with more views of Carsington water. There's a little bridge, gate at the end of it, bridge goes over a ditch, there's no water in the ditch but just wanted to show Jill going over here safely and <laughs> she gets caught up on the gate post holding her poles in one hand fastening the gate whilst there's a huge opening on the other side so a bit pointless no need to go through it at all but fun to do
want to know more about joining our walks once restrictions are lifted or if you're wanting to learn how to use the poles through our technique course just contact sam at walksdoenanddales.co.uk